as I do this, you audience will probably say I raise my left hand. When in fact in my point, it is my right hand. Ladies and gentlemen, everything is just a matter of perspective. What's good for me may not be good for you or for anyone else. A six for me could be someone's nine. Sometimes my low could be anyone's high. We are compelled by nature to view things not as they are, but as we are ourselves. We are basically portraying our own perceptions, our own paradigms. Every person has their own way of looking at things, the way we were raised, the environment we grew up in, and the experiences we've had all have influenced how we see and experience the world. Every day we come across various point of views, and not being open about those ideas could lead into such controversies. It is important for us to remember that whenever we are to deal in this kind of circumstances, the best way we could do is to respect the conversation if the other party's viewpoint is directly opposed to yours. It is not required for you to accept it, but rather recognize that he or she is looking at things from their own perspective. We must understand where they are coming from. As Albert Einstein said, peace cannot be kept by force. It can only be achieved by understanding. Try to listen to his or her point and ask for reasons why he or she believe in such things. Then, if it doesn't satisfy you, then simply respect for their right to an opinion, let go, and move on. You should never give that individual power over your feelings and mental state. Maybe their parachute is closed, for it cannot be fly. Maybe their mind is closed, for it cannot think and consider. Whatever the case is, whether favorable or not, the most valuable point to remember while dealing in other people's perspective is to treat, the, treat them with tolerance, understanding, and respect. We all have various beliefs and keep in mind that yours will not be the most prevalent. After all, respect doesn't imply tolerating people's differences, but rather to acknowledge, understand, and learn from them. Thank you very much.